We're all made of atoms, and we're all made of molecules. And many of our atoms in our molecules are hydrogen. And the hydrogen nucleus is uh, like a dipole. It's like a magnetic dipole. It's a small magnet within the body. So if we were to put very strong magnets next to a patient and create a uniform magnetic field, then these hydrogen nuclei will align themselves and be very uniform in the direction of their orientation in the body. And if you will imagine that these are individual hydrogen nuclei, protons, the protons in different areas of different environments will act differently if we were to disturb them. So imagine, if you will, that we send a very noxious pulse into the body, and we make them all fairly upset. They'll start to scream. Um, over time, the uh, screaming in the calcium areas, the screaming in the soft tissue areas, and screaming in the fat areas will go away. And if we wait long enough, then only the screaming will remain of the protons in the water. And if we listen, just at this time, we can get images of the body that are virtually only water. So this is a cross-section of the body, and the liver and the muscles have very little water, but the gallbladder, the insides of your bowel, uh, and the kidneys have a lot of water. And certain things like tumors also have a lot of water. And so we can look for water maps of the patients by magnetic resonance imaging.